Now we're sitting down talking about it. Yes, yeah. It's kind of like, oh, yeah, I can't mm -hmm. believe it. Yeah. yeah, I mean, only you survivor. know your pain. You're mm -hmm. a survivor. Yeah. So that's what you're here for. What's the message? What do you want to say to those women out there or to those men out there? It's never okay to hit uh, a person, whether it's a man or a woman. Uh -huh. You should always talk in communication. And if it can, you can communicate, just time, maybe you should part. Because you should never put your hand, your, your hand on, this, on a person that's not your child. But what happened if child. you're sick? What happened now? I'm in the shot. You see, Gloria, I took myself out of the shot. That was pretty cool. <laughs> I can direct my show, too. Yeah? And I can talk and I can listen. Yeah. <laughs> right? You guys having a good time so far? Yeah. 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 This yeah. is good? Yeah. Yes. Good. Um, God, I lost my train of thought. This is not good. Well, what yeah, do you, do? you actually said, like, uh, what's, what's the message that we, yes. like, she wants to give? I think her message for everyone um, is just, you don't have to be a victim. Right. Just right. because things were done to you, you know, you don't have to now do that onto the world because these things were done to you. We know what it is to do good because we feel it. When you do something bad, you feel mm -hmm. bad about it. But some right. people are sick. Some people, like, we carry a level of affliction, mm -hmm. and it's not that easy to move on. You can it's love not. God, and you can be close to God. I always recommend to be, mm -hmm. even say your prayers out loud, because mm -hmm. it gives you strength it does. When, you, it does. when you do, okay? But um, affliction and mental illness and mental problems, and I mean, everybody hurts. Yes. Everybody. And it's not that easy to say, okay, don't do this, don't do that. That's not good. You go that way, you go that way. Mm -hmm. it, life doesn't work that no, way. So. Um, very unfortunately, we have to go through pain Definitely. to see the light. Yeah. We have to go through that dark path yes. Yes. to be able to find yes. the light. Yes. You know your life, mm -hmm. and you said that you're a survivor. Yes. What has been the most difficult thing you have ever done? Um, being without a mother, growing up by myself, and getting away from my kid's father was a little difficult for me, but I the, did the it, kid. yes. But you did it. I did it, and... What gave you courage? My children. Your children? Yes. Every, every day, we had 10 minutes to go. Thank mm -hmm. you, Gloria. My children gave me the motivation to get out, because I said, wow, I can do bad by myself. I, I, gotta, I gotta do it for them. Right. You know, so and no other man has ever come. If their father didn't come, no other man was going to make me be a bad mother to my children. My kids right. always was first, and that's why they turned out to be great people. Went through school, because went I always college. put them first. Yes. 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 And then meeting my mother was like my dreams come true. Yeah, you know, let's like, talk about that. Yes. Facebook. Yes. Let's talk about that. Tomorrow. I've always looked for her for years. Yes. You know? Then one day I just happened to put it. It was in the summer. and. I put her name and a picture came out. I said, yo, this lady looks just like me, mama. We call her mama. Uh -huh. I, she's like, well, friend her. I befriended her, no answer. So I befriended one of her friends. I left a message on her page. Right. Come to find out, she was my mother. So she, my, so my we, son Raheem. So you see, was no private detectives no. here. No. My you, son Raheem actually befriended my mother and my brother, Luis, before I even befriended them. And she's like, this boy looks like me. They got the Alejandro nose. We got a big nose. Uh -huh. I have a small nose compared to my, my uh -huh, family. Uh -huh. I like that, that <laughs> earring over there is very cute. Thank you, thank very you. nice. <laughs> so, um, yep, and I found out she's my mother. She had six children. I have four brothers, one sister, seven cousins. Oh, God. Yeah, and, and an auntie. We're all looking I have for a her. Yes. For all these But years. I changed my name. My name was Omaira Cruz Alejandro. When I became part of New York State, I had to drop one. They were getting me confused with my social security number, you know, all this stuff. Uh -huh. So I had to choose. They say, oh, my, you have to choose. So I chose Cruz because it was shorter. Right. Not because it was my father's name, because I really didn't care for either one of them, you know, right. at, at that time. Right. So, you know, and then come to find out, yep, yeah, that was my mother. And, and do you girls keep in touch? Yes, we do. I Every try to call day? her once. No, I call her once a month because oh, sometimes once a month? I it's run new. out of things to it's say. New, it's right. new, right? Yeah, them. it's like, both. Yeah, they're both just still shocked yeah. that right. they actually found each other. Yeah. Right. Um, when we went to Puerto Rico, it was like amazing. It's like everybody yeah. knew the story, and like to have like the town be at the house. Like, it was pretty much like the town. It was, mm -hmm. uh, the house was packed with people. Mm -hmm. And just looking at her, she was like this miracle was child like, <laughs> that was stolen 40-something yeah. years ago to then come back to Puerto Rico. It ago. was, it was And great. my father was the one that shipped me to New York without her permission on a visit. Yeah. 
she took him, she took me to visit him, and he took it upon himself to sign the birth certificate, ship me to America like I was up in knee. You know what, yeah. I, sometimes <laughs> I wonder, you know, what, what's wrong with yeah. people, man? And that's the first thing she said. What's she wrong? She said, I, yes, I'm your mother, and I did not abandon you. That's the first thing that she said. she said to me. So I'm like, what happened? So I'm crying. Nobody's home. I'm like, what am I going to do? All these emotions. I've waited right, for this right, moment right, all my life. Right, right, what right. do I say? Right. And I was like, OK, well, tell me what happened. And that's when she told me. I said, OK, it's OK. We got to meet. We got to find out. You know. And, I, I forgive you. What people lie, what people you. do what they exactly. do. What's wrong? It's like no more explaining, I forgive you, and I have never talked about that again. It's like just a new chapter. A new chapter. In my life. In a book. It's going to be a book. Yes. yes. Can we talk amazing. about it? Because time is running out. Yes. Um, hopefully, mm. in the next year or two, um, we're definitely want to put her life in just a the many miracles that she's experienced is just it's a lot of blessings and we that's something that we need to celebrate and yes. talk about and um her book is going to be called titled uh found after 43 yeah, I like years that title. Good um, job. Nice. And yeah it's just yeah just telling her life story it's it's yeah. amazing and it's, i think other people should hear it too and it's yes. inspiring because we need to hear stories like this mm -hmm. we need to know because people like i say everybody's too concerned I, you know, I was thinking last night when I was, I got home so late and I was like, I get the news, I go to Facebook, check my <laughs> email, I said, why is everybody big... so damn concerned Excuse about me. how they look like? Yeah. This is so, I mean, it's, it's sad mm -hmm. because uh, to me, what you see, what you get with yeah, me, you don't see yeah. me posing here doing anything. Mm -hmm. Weird. I'm the same way. I'm a real uh, person. Uh, right, but you know? why people are so concerned about how they look outside? You should be a little concerned about how you look inside. Yeah, inside, exactly. You, you can be. How do you feel you know? inside? It's exactly. not about how many pounds you lost. No. You know, it's not about you know. It's about your mind mm -hmm. and your soul. Yeah, so and your energy. You know, and how you mm -hmm. find that balance. Yes. Yes. But I wonder, we have five minutes to go. Before we go, I want to thank my sponsors, my God, Dwayne Harris, and sending my love to you, and mm -hmm. Caterina Lankova for wearing, you know, getting the clothes. This sweater is mine. Sweater <laughs> by what the hell? I love you, baby. Jairo Suleta, um, Franco Neri Velotti, Chris Kosak, the boys at sales. We got everybody in the house. Uh, Diana, she's doing our sales now. A very good friend of mine, Gloria Messer, as always, she comes here to support me. And we're sending a lot to your friend in the studio, Delilah. She came here to took some pictures. And we have somebody watching us, hopefully. Jovi is her name, right? Yes. yes. Sending a lot to you, Jovi. Jovi I don't yeah. know Ariana. you. And Ariana and everybody else, girls. I think you girls are having a good time. Yes. Yeah. Yes. We're just, it's, it's a, it's a celebration. Like it's a positive thing. Mm -hmm. And it's just, if you are positive and you have that positive energy, Anything, any, awesome. anything dreams, is possible. Is. Anything happen. is possible. Have you read that book, The Secret? I sure did. <laughs> See that's the one that I did. That. That's a book to read. <laughs> yes. That's a book I think to I'm gonna read. read that yeah. Oh, you yes, bet. You gotta get a hold. Yeah. I'm gonna ask you. Okay. Number one, how come you and me were not friends on Facebook? I know, right? We're gonna be friends uh, on Facebook today. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I wanna see that friend request. I on got my lots phone. of pictures from Puerto Rico. I know. I wanna <laughs> see your mama. Your mama. You call it mama, right? Yeah. yeah. So basically, we look like twins. You look like twins. I'm the only one that looked exactly like, like her. Like her. Yeah. Oh my God! What did Kinda they say to you when they? Side. When you guys saw uh -huh. each other, it's, when you were she was high. crying, she was holding a card, "Welcome home, Amara." Oh, so beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. That made me feel very special. Yeah, but you are special. <laughs> yeah. You're special. You're such a trooper. I tell you, to be able to bring your children the way you did. Yes. Your daughter is such a winner. I didn't yes. know you Thank when you. we met, when I had my mouth wide open. <laughs> and I told you, you're so special. Yeah. Thank and you. I said, I don't know your mama. I don't know your dad. I don't know your life. But I can tell you that your mother did a hell of a job. Thank I don't you. know if you remember, but no, I told you I do. that. I remember that. So you did. Thank you. And it's every reason to feel good and yes, to be I happy do. and to yes. fight for what you want That's and right. never give up. That's right. Okay? Yes. And always, like I said, guys, keep yourself close to God. Thank yeah. You. Yes. And send a love to everybody who's watching. Gloria, it's, such a, it's emotional because it's a special. Thank it's you. It's beautiful to hear about it. This is something yeah. that people want to hear. Yes. We need to connect. Yes. Right? We yes. need to keep it 
Keep it real. Yeah, 100. Keep it real. 100%. 100%. And yeah. I tell you, we got, what, two minutes to go. Excuse Make sure that Malik get those credits going. I love you, Malik. It's not that I'm not trusting you. I just want to make sure that we get it done, baby. I love you, Malik. I, you know you do. Deshaun is not here. I don't know what happened to Deshaun. Is Richard there, too? Yeah, I can see it. Well, we're still <laughs> close to go. But I want that yeah. friend request. Yes. And you know what might help you really to keep a diary? Yes, you're right. To keep a diary, to mm -hmm. write things down. Yes. It helps a great deal to watch good movies. Do you like to read? Um, yeah, no, not really. <laughs> I give you one piece of advice. Uh -huh. Read. Okay. And I'm not kidding. Not uh -huh. only the Bible, not only the secret. Uh -huh. Get into reading. Okay. It's very important. Not only for your mind, for your soul. Okay. It's, it's, you have a whole life ahead of you. Yes. Yeah. When this you is really, just the beginning. This yes. is just the beginning. <laughs> it's a new chapter for yes. you. So it's a lot. Ah, and of course, I didn't say hi and bye to Alex and Charles and George Santana and everybody else who helped me on a weekly basis. How can I do that, man? I can't believe it. And I will, guys, see you next week. Who's the guest next week? God, I forgot. I have a musical guest. She's coming by Dwayne Harris. I promise you guys are going to keep your...